Man Prepper, and today I'm going to build a long fire. So I'm staying out in the, in the uh, hammock tonight, and I thought I'd try building a long fire. I'm not using this as a heat source, uh, it's basically just to see if I can do it. So what I've started with is uh, a long piece of wood that I split with my splitting ball. This is uh, any kind of wood that you'd uh, find out in the woods. It's old and uh, there's no bark on it. It's all seasoned. So hopefully it'll start good. So what I've done is I split it. I've got two pieces here that are going to hold the top off of the uh, bottom. I'm going to fill this with tinder and get it going and then put the top on and it should burn for quite a while. But uh, you know how I am with fires, we'll see how that goes. So right now I'm going to uh, uh, baton some wood, I uh, got some bark, I'm going to get some more uh, grass and weeds, and then uh, I'm going to use a, a fire starting square to get this going. So the top, I'm just going to rough it up. That'll help uh, get that top burn and we'll set that off to the side. Let's go find some grass. Well, it's going. We'll see what happens.
right there. Of course, my hammock is just to the left. regular stove going here. Let me take you around this fire. Backside of that. All the heat's going towards that hammock. Got a stick there to balance it. I mean, I'm standing, again, I'm standing like four or five feet away and I could easily feel that heat. They call that a clamshell fire. Kind of a cool idea. Let's call it clamshell fire. So I have my browning. Uh, sleeping bag, this is an extra large sized one. I don't know exactly the temperature it goes to, but this thing's heavy. Uh, it goes, I think it goes down to either uh, freezing or zero. But uh, we'll find out tonight. I'm not roughing it tonight. I guess this isn't, this is kind of roughing it, but I'm not going to run my wool blanket tonight. Uh, Cody's or uh, Kid Prepper is not staying out with me tonight. And uh, this is just to, to test this hammock and uh, see if it'll do 30 without... Uh, I am in the hammock. Ta-da! Not really tired, but I didn't want to come out here any later. So I'm out here in the pea pod. The only thing issue I have now is my fire, which is over there on the side of my opening, is blowing smoke into here. But other than that, I'm toasty warm. I'm doing it so you don't have to. 3.03 in the morning on Friday. Good morning. 3.04 in the morning. Um, I slept really good when I go to bed. It uh, went to bed at what, 9.30? I slept really good. I hadn't went to bed that early in a long time. Been up YouTube until 2 in the morning lately. Well, let me show you the fire just so you know I'm still in this thing. And I did show you it's 3 o'clock. but There it is. Three little coals. Sure does look a lot brighter out. Sometimes the camera picks up dark and sometimes it doesn't. That's it for now. We'll talk to you when uh, when I decide to get out of this thing. Morning.
it is now 7.30. And I'm going to get up and get out of this thing. Slept good again. Man, that was nice. The hammock turned on me again. It's The, the, the line is vertical right here. Which is weird. But anyway... I'm gonna get up and go inside. <sighs> There's what's left of my fire. Oh, I'm still tired. That all burned down pretty good. It's gonna be a beautiful day. It's supposed to be 50 degrees today. January 19th, supposed to be 50 degrees in Michigan. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, click like, post a comment, share it. Head back to the webs or head back to the channel. Check out the videos there. Click subscribe if you haven't already. This lazy man prepper out. Boom. Are all about getting back or uh, surviving different situations. There's Cody's, and there's mine. Lazy Man Prepper, out.